Hey guys and gals, hope everyone is having a good week. This is Jason from Las Vegas. I'm here in my studio, Wad Studio. I wanted to show you and demo and review the new Fopstar Amplification Royal Preamp. I just received this pedal last week and it's pretty amazing actually. It is now in permanent staple in my rig as well as in my studio. So I wanted to show you guys some different tones with different guitars and different amps and see what you guys think. Uh, it's pretty great, I'm enjoying it and I think it'll definitely help some of your tones and it helps mine. So. So what is the Royal Preamp? Is it a distortion pedal? Is it an overdrive? Is it a compressor? So generally when preamp pedals are actually engaged or turned up, they generally provide harmonic saturation and sustain. Uh, so I'm gonna read this right from this manual right here. Nice little handy dandy thing sent to me. As you turn the volume control for this preamp clockwise, you will increase overall dynamics, increase gain structure, and notice a richer harmonic content. So I will be demoing this through my rig. My rig actually consists of a few different guitars, uh, 339 Custom, Les Paul, a Tele, and maybe I'll break out some of my PRS models. Uh, my rig is actually a digital as well as an analog hybrid. So what I do is actually go through my Kemper, which is a Jubilee style setting, and then a Bassman. So my Bassman actually has an overdrive in it, which is the Friedman OD overdrive. So uh, any questions about that, hit me up in the comments. The sounds you're hearing actually are left and right. So on the left, you'll actually hear the Kemper, which is digital. And on the right, you'll actually hear my basement with the Friedman Overdrive. Here is my rig, pedal bypass, straight up. Here's my rig with the pedal engaged. My rig with the pedal. the pedal.
So for the examples that I played for you guys, I pretty much had the pedal at 12 o'clock. It seems like for my rig, the sustain and the amount of saturation, harmonics, whatever you call it, it works the best for my rig. You'll definitely see what works for your rig, whether dialed up or dialed back, but right at that noon seems to work for mine. Thanks for listening, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. And to Drew, thank you for creating such a cool pedal. I can't wait to see what 2019, what crazy-ass shit you build. And uh, thank you very much, man. Appreciate it. <laughs>